So I'm Angela, I'm from Ghana in West Africa. This is my Nigerian colleague. We have a lot of banter going on as to whether which country has the best jollof, but that's for another day. <laughs> so on the question of which energy is most feasible to be implemented in Ghana, just to give a perspective, currently electricity is 66% from thermal power plants, mainly natural gas and crude oil, and 33% from hydropower, gui, home, and then Akosumbo dams. Solar utilization in Ghana is um, currently just under 1%. However, Ghana receives a lot of sunshine, around 1,800 to 3,000 sunshine hours per year. So we have the high BNI required for solar integration, but it's not integrated in our system. And I think that it's a good opportunity we, we could look at. Um, currently, some two generating power institutions in Ghana, the Bree Power Authority and the Bota River Authority, are looking at implementing a 250 megawatt solar plant. And I think that this this would be a good adaptation for rural communities which are not connected to the grid yeah. and also for urban and peri-urban areas. The main challenge as highlighted by my colleague Mark is with the intermittency with solar. In as much as we are integrating solar, we would also have to look at generation or storage backup opportunities to ensure that there is continuous energy. Yeah. That's my take on it. Thank you. Well.